Hello everybody, what I'm going to show you today is one of the newest knives released by Quartermaster Knives. This one here is the QSE7TT, the Spicoli. And Quartermaster Knives is really good at social media, very responsive on their Instagram, and the build up to getting this knife has been, in my opinion, enormous. And it is really quite a specimen. So a beautiful Spicoli knife right here. Let's see what's in the box first. Of course, just the catalog showing the current Quartermaster knives available. Um, we do have another pocket clip. So not only does it come with a titanium pocket clip uh, set for right-hand carry, it also has another clip you can set on the left-hand side if you're a southpaw. So that's a very cool addition. So that's in the box. And of course, the certificate. So what I'm really excited about, this is number eight. So I love getting uh, low number knives. And uh, I ordered this knife as soon as it became available on their website. So that was, I believe, Wednesday maybe, the day before Thanksgiving. And so lovely knife, lovely certificate. Uh, but that is the box. <clears throat> Check out the knife itself. This is gorgeous. You can tell a lot of thought went into making this knife. And my lighting's not even too good here, but it is a titanium frame lock. <clears throat> and out of the box, let me explain this knife in one word, describe this knife in one word, perfection. It is a flipper. Knife flies right out of the handle. They got this one right. Everything is just meticulously engineered to do it right. Take a look at the the frame lock there. It has a steel insert on the lock bar. And you can see the lock up right there is just right in the middle where it needs to be. It runs on bearings, so it is just amazingly, flawlessly smooth. There is no play or wiggle in this blade one bit. And so this is, there, without a doubt, in my opinion, their best design to date. It is just a simple, elegant knife made from really nice materials. Um, titanium frame lock. The blade is a Texas T finish, which is that black stone wash, which is just done very well. <clears throat> you can see the markings on the blade right here, if it'll focus on it. There you go. USA made number eight of 300. Number eight. And so this knife currently, today is Cyber Monday. I know that they have some of these on Blade HQ for $198. I don't know what their regular price will be after today. And if they're even available after today, you know, so it's, if, this, if you want this knife, get it now. Um, you can compare it to some of its stable mates here. This one here is the um, QTR6. And so this one is a, a, a steel frame lock. So you can compare the thickness here. This one also has a very nice flipper, very nice action. And then of course the QTR1, which is of course entirely different knife. But you can see the comparison right here. Blade on this one is three and a half inches. <clears throat> Overall length about eight inches. Just a beautiful knife. You can see there's some jimping here on the top of the blade. Pocket clip has good tension. It just slides right back into the handle. So this is a knife done right, and it was worth every minute of the wait. Because on Instagram, Quartermaster is typically very responsive, and they've been advertising this knife available availability for a long time. So... Uh, a lot of people have been looking forward to it. So it, if you want this knife, get it as soon as possible. I predict these will sell out. I mean, the fit and finish on this blade is just amazing for its price range. Uh, so this hits in right at $200. Hopefully, I don't know if it's going to go up after Cyber Monday sales. But if you can get it at that price, it is really an excellent deal. So USA made blade, CPM 154 steel, titanium frame lock. Perfect centering. You need to check that out. Everything on this knife, just right out of the box. Man, impressive. So, order one now. I'm tempted to get another one. <laughs> just have two of them. 
Uh, the Blade HQ version is supposed to be a little different. I think it's a stonewashed handle, and uh, that's not not much else. But if you have any questions about this knife, feel free to ask. But this is the QSE7 Spicoli from Quartermaster Knives. Holy moly, I'm glad I waited for this one. Awesome. Thank you.